My name is Bill and I walk dogs. I often come twice a day because I know how much the dogs love to get out. And when I'm there, I can add a little bit extra to their lives by walking them with other dogs, by taking them to the playground with other dogs, and enriching their lives through socialization. Bill. Oh, I love Bill. Um, he is, first of all, he's here almost every day. Um, I would say more than staff. Um, he comes in on his lunch, and that is huge. And he doesn't have much time, but he does it anyway. Um, he just comes in and gets a few walks in, and you know it's going to be with the harder dogs, too. I just consider myself a guy who comes in to help the dogs and try to make them better animals and be with other people and I'm not sure there's anything heroic about it, it's just fun. I think the animals would be a lot unhappier obviously, um, less socialized with the volunteers, um, more difficult to adopt. And uh, without the volunteers uh, coming in every day to help out, um, dogs are, have emotional centers and they would be very depressed animals and probably not as good to adopt. And so the volunteers do have a very important role. I think Bill's amazing. Um, I am in awe of his dedication and his commitment to these dogs. He's here every single day. Monday through Friday at noon for an hour. Um, I find it somewhat funny when he walks in in his near suit and he slips into the bathroom and he comes out in his volunteer with his cape and he's there to just take the dogs out and he's there for a good hour, hour 15 minutes. He leaves and then he's back at five. I don't know if he eats lunch. I don't know what he does, but he's amazing. Um, in addition, the fact that he has Foster some of our hardest dogs, dogs that I thought would be here for a while. Rhea, and Clover, Duke, and Lox. He's had Lox now for a couple months. Um, so I just know off the bill. I think he's amazing. Yes, I started or helped to start I should say a couple of uh, really big and important programs for the shelter tandem walks and play groups um, with the help of my wife who has a lot of expertise in dog behavior um, we've gotten so that we can uh, allow the dogs to play together in the yard where they didn't used to get used to other dogs and uh, we do tandem walks which are a little bit simpler but allow people and dogs uh, to interact um, while on a walk and get used to other people and other dogs. And it's fun for both humans and the dogs. And, uh, not just me, a lot of volunteers have gone into helping get that started. <laughs>